No, it's a great question. When you do your first order, it's kind of like my rule of thumb is when I do, when I do my, through my consulting, my recommended typically it's around 40 to 50 trays worth. So that kind of gets you up and running. You don't need to buy a year's worth of product. You also don't need to buy 50 different types of seed. I recommend starting with like five to seven seeds max. The 10 day cycle crops for us, the ones we initially start with and still are pretty much our highest revenue crops would be like your peas, your brassicas, so radishes, broccoli, kale, arugula, and maybe a mix to throw in there and sunflowers possibly. You want a diversified menu, but you also want to see what your market's going to bear. And, de and it's determined by what's your directive. If you're doing just farmer's markets, you're going to see pretty quick what do people like to buy. If you're selling to chefs, you're going to see that same thing. So maybe your market, and you guys, I decided to go to Madison and start selling there more on a commercial side, you're seeing pea shoots are flying out the door. Well, then you're probably going to order more pea shoots. Your first order is just going to be to get you going. And then your subsequent orders will be based upon what you're running out first and what your volume demands. Everything at our farm, for example, is grown to order. We have no excess, no waste. So I already know exactly how many trays of each go every week. I multiply those trays by, let's say, my seed density. So let's say even numbers. Let's say I'm using a tray, 10 trays a week of X product and it's 10 grams. I'm using 100 grams per week. If I have 1,000 grams on site, I have 10 weeks worth of product. But if I all of a sudden get a huge order and now I go up to 15 or 20 trays, well, now I just drop my inventory by half, right? And with seed right. order, it can take up to three weeks now. You're maybe down to two weeks to order. So what was 10 weeks is now a two-week lead time. You got to get on it. So I just do inventory days. I do a weekly inventory day. Mine's a Friday where I just do a seed count and a container count. And I see what I need. My recommendation right now is probably three to four months of seed and containers. Probably seed, not necessarily containers, on site at all times. For me, I usually have about a month's worth of soil because containers and soil for me are readily available. I know that seed can be a flux product right now, depending on what the market demands, you know, because everyone's ordering from all over the place from my seed company, you know, fully apocalyptic. Yeah. Style, right? So you got to prep for that. So I have my farm, I have six months on site because we go through a lot of product, but if you run out, it happens, but at least you have the lead time to let your clients know that possibly it might not be in stock down the road or alternatively, at least it gives you time to find and source the same seed from another company. So for me, that's kind of doing a good starting amount. Usually I say about 40 to 50 trays worth, and that will let you start to sell, see the products moving towards, and maybe your town hates spicy food for whatever reason. Great. And radish yeah. might not be a good idea to pile into it. So point being is you're not going to be ordering consistently the first of every month. I order as needed. My last order before the one I just did right now, actually, was December, and I just put order in about two weeks ago. So yeah. because also I close our restaurants closed all December, January. So we didn't need as much seed in that area. So especially in today's time, you don't know what's going to be happening on the governing side. So you don't want to be ordering a ton of seed. And it won't go bad per se, but it's just, you know, in dead inventory or inventory with costs that you're not using. Yeah. So okay. Yeah. But, okay. And build it a week. yeah. Build an inventory day like you would. So bi-weekly or weekly, pick a day that you can focus on it. And then that should be good.